So we have this crazy world, and it gets crazier. The idea is to keep us so focused on survival. It's like that uh, mass mind control manual that came to light a few years ago called Silent Weapons for a Quiet War, how to manipulate the population. And one of the lines in it said, keep them busy, busy, busy back on the farm with the other animals. So the more you can keep us in a state of survival, more and more stress. Look, mate, I, I, you might be saying interesting things, but I, I, I live in the real world, mate. That's the idea, to keep us in that state of stress. And we're now bringing it to younger and younger people. People, kids under tremendous stress to pass exams, to show how indoctrinated they are, the system. Oh, you got, must pass your exams. Oh, my son got a so and so. I've seen on car stickers. My son got so and so, so and so. We're very pleased for you. By the way, he got it. You didn't. This parental glory seeking. Oh, go on, you've got to pass your exams. You're going to be a banker. Your mum wants you to be a banker. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Whatever happened to life? How do you spell happy, teacher? I mean, I mean, what's all that about? We ever talk about that? Are you happy? Are you fulfilled? You know, pe people, we have these um, measurements of success that are sold to us that we take on, and they're all about more, more and more and more. How more, many more people are this? How many more people are that? How many more people are this? How many more people are past degrees? How many more people are better mortgage? How many more people? Yeah, it's the other way. Tell us the real story. How few people are unfulfilled. How few people are under stress. How few people are ill. How few people are homeless. How few people are terrified of the future. These are the, the measurements of a success of society, surely. Not more and more and more. You know, we have, we have an economic system, which I call take, make and throw away, where the whole thing of success is called economic growth, is how fast you can take from the earth, turn it into things, sell more things, throw away more things and start again. The faster you do that, the more successful you are. And we call it the cutting edge of human society. It's turn, turning the, 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 the planet into a shite hole. And we have um, the cleverness up to a point, although if we went to wisdom, we would find that technologically we would advance by enormous strides. But we have the cleverness through mind at the moment to create some amazing technology. Things that could make the world a better place for everybody. But we use that technology to pepper bomb cities full of civilians. We are now such at the cutting edge of human evolution that we can kill more people than ever before and we do we're in a world where it seems okay for children to sign their names on bombs that then drop and kill other children like I say we think the world is sane well we people in this room don't but so many people do when it is utterly insane. And what keeps people from understanding this? The constant hypnotic trance that we put in. You are feeling sleepy. Tick tock, tick tock. You don't want to know about pepper bombing cities. Watch this, shut up. Quick, honey, uh, she's going for the car. Whoa. We live in a world of plenty, and yet people starve for the want of the basics. We have food galore in some parts of the world, which comes often from the parts of the world that go hungry. And we throw away more food than most people eat in many, many months. I've seen this, I've seen this in Ecuador people living on rubbish tips waiting for the uh, vans to come from the western hotels to pour the, 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 the rubbish food, thrown away food on and then they go and eat for the day from it. The 
world that we have allowed to happen. But don't look at that. Tick tock, tick tock. Look at this. Shut up. Hey, quick, honey. Steelers are gonna score. Cool, yeah, yeah. I got nothing against that. I love sport. But if we are in a situation where that becomes the focus of our reality at the exclusion of everything else, then while we're looking here, hell is going on here to stitch us up in the way that we have been. Oh, shut up. What's on the telly, honey? I mean, we, 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 we drop bombs on the most crowded piece of land on the earth, Gaza. We protect ourselves, I think. We do it to protect ourselves. This is what we do. This is liberation. Hey, liberation. And it's been going on. This is, this is Vietnam. In the 20th century, humans killed well in excess of a hundred million other humans in wars and conflicts.